In this short video, we're going to look at how we delete company files in Sage. Um, we might do this when we've got too many companies saved on there. Um, we're using a multi-company version of Sage, but there are only so many companies that we can set up on it. So the first thing that we do is we go into Sage. So that's what I'll do as normal. And that brings up the um, list of companies um, uh, for whom data has been entered into Sage. Now, I want to get rid of the step to and some limited example. Um, but the thing is, um, you've got to make sure that you don't go into the company or the business data um, that you want to delete. So rather than go into step to and some, I'll go into Wakefield College and click on OK. Now that that's been done, I'll go up to File, down to Delete Company, and then Wake, uh, the Sage will give me a list of all of the different companies apart from Wakefield College, and I can select the one that I want to delete. Well, obviously, Steptone Sun is the only one listed there, so I'll click on OK, and Sage will then give me a warning message. Do I really want to continue? If I click on yes, Sage will then go through the process of deleting that company. So it's done that. I'll click on OK. OK again. Cancel. And now if I come out of Sage and go back into Sage, you'll see that step and son is no longer an option. And that is how we can delete company data. But just remember that you've got to be very careful when doing so. Um, make sure that that is exactly what you want to do.